So, uh, what are you guys doing here? We ought to be asking you how you get here. We're through the garden. Sigma, hand. Here you go. You three came in through the blue door, right? And which room did you go into? The garden. The really big Bee garden? One. Oh, that leads to the same place as... Okay. What about you guys? Well, after we went through the green... How come everyone else goes into the treatment center except for me? I get sent to the robot So, lab. what's the treatment? sounds a lot like the infirmary. You want to have a look? We can go back to any of the... Sure, let's take a look in the, uh, in the treatment center again. So? Not like I've been here before on alternate timelines. Very fancy. They're why this is called a treatment center. Those pods can cure a number of illnesses and even repair certain injuries. Ooh. So if I break Dio's arm and we stick him in there, it'll fix it? How about you climb in one of them, Dio? Why? Well, maybe it can fix whatever's wrong with your brain. Ooh, sick bird! Uh, hey, you want to start something, lady? Calm down now, son. You don't cool off a bit and I'll have to throw you in one of these pods here. That's what she's trying to do. Huh? Why? Weren't you paying attention? They have a cold sleep function. I figured that ought to cool your head up. <laughs> yeah? Maybe we've been in According to some records we found in here, until about eight hours ago, there were three frozen people in these pods. Huh. Three people? You mean three? We don't know. All we found was what was in the logs for the pods. No idea. Part of the logs were erased. What? All that's left is when the cold sleep function turned off. It records them thawing out, getting up. Then they could be anyone. Well, anyone but you. Because you don't need a device like this to freeze Alice. What? Am I wrong? Huh? What are you talking about? You don't need to play dumb. The water in your body isn't normal water. It's something called Ice-9. Oh, no. It freezes at 96.8 degrees. That means all you have to do to put yourself in cold sleep is drop your body temperature below 96.8. No fancy machine needed. Where on earth? From Clover. Clover? What? When we were exploring the lounge during the... I see. <laughs> What's so okay? funny? Oh, man. You fell for that... Clover was messing with you. That is, if she even said anything to you at all. It was a lie. A joke? No, I'm sure about it. You're well, you're mistaken. It's a ridiculous misunderstanding. Some point in the past, frozen mummified Egyptian queen, vacation, all ice, Alice, ice nine. They say that the mummy finally thawed, and when it did, and ever since then, I've had people say they thought I was her. Well, I was pretty sure you were her. I mean, really? How could anyone believe something so ridiculous? I did play the first game. The existence of this mysterious Alice and of this ice that doesn't melt are just urban legends. It can't just be because your name's Alice. There are tons of Alices. Is it because of your fate? Well... It, can I really be blamed if people think I'm an Egyptian queen? I thought you were a priestess. I don't think that's the only reason, though. Someone who made that mistake said something to me once. They claimed they'd seen me before. Of course, I immediately prepped. Do you mean the mummy, Alice? When? Where? Of course, they were at a loss. In fact, I began to feel a little sorry for them. So I told them something. If you're so convinced, then... But maybe I've lost my memory and can't remember who I am. I'm sure she would go home if she could, but we're kind of stuck here. I'm still not sure why Clover would tell you something like that, though. Even if she was just messing with you, it seems... You really think she put that much thought into it? She was probably just screwing with him, and it was the first thing that came to mind. Maybe she wanted to see if she could get him to believe something completely ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, I could see her doing something like that. Well, I think that's enough idle gossip for now. The cold sleep business is interesting, but I don't think it... We should go see if the other team has returned to the warehouse yet. Interesting. It looks like another warehouse. 
It looks like the same warehouse. But with different writing. Hey, look. Three more doors? They're all glowing white. Where's the rest of the people? I'd bet on it. How much look, are you betting on they've it? got the same boxes next to them as the other door. So the next set of doors are... white? They haven't all been the same color before. Uh, we definitely need to tell the others about this. We do. <laughs> Is that them? No. It's never gonna be them. Get late notification. The number of minutes I've spent watching them walk around and push elevator buttons, and open doors, is far too high in comparison to the amount of time I've actually been playing the game. It should be a less than 5% ratio. Right now, it's over 5%. And that's not good. Well, at least Dio didn't open the door prematurely this time. Oh, thank you. You finally returned. I was beginning to get... Yes, it's Quark, you see. What? Damn it. What happened to Quark? He collapsed. It happened so suddenly. What? Please, you... Clover is looking after him. You should go. Take him to the treatment center. Oh, no. How come Quark always gets knocked out by something? Quark, come on, kid. Get a hold of yourself. Quark, wake up, you dirty scrub. Hey, what? He's sick, and we don't even know what's wrong. What if you make him worse? <sighs> then what am I supposed to do? Let Luna scan him with a scanner. I have to save him. Save? Maybe he just has anemia or something. No, that's not. I know him better than any of you. He doesn't have anemia. Well, then call an ambulance. son of a bitch. Listen. We can't call an the ambulance. infirmary seems pretty. There are plenty of diagnostic tools without a doctor. <laughs> Luna? Uh, that's right. You have a medical... Wait. Is that true, Luna? Um, well... Please. Okay. Save I'll him. see what I... I think that what? machine over there is a medical scanner. It's called an atom. It uses Stop nuclear magnetic resonance imaging things. to examine... <laughs> and save him. Yes, I believe it can. I don't want to... Just let us know if you need anything. Of course. We can trap him in one of the treatment pods for an hour until we have to do the next stage of the thing. Well, I feel so t Quark has an in- Oh no. Yeah, let me guess, Radical yes, Six? he's been infected. Yeah, yeah. I told Al- Fi and I heard it. Blah, 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 Radical Six. He can't. How could he have gotten it? Go to the treatment center. There must be something we can do! How can we cure him? Well, Adams, it's the only way to get. Where it? Shouldn't it be in the infirmary somewhere? Yeah, we looked around. I don't trust a damn thing. I'm asking Luna. I'm sorry, but Theo's telling them we didn't find anything. Treatment damn center. It. What about the other room? Sigma, what about you? <laughs> What about you, Kay? Was there any medicine? We visited the laboratory. There were a number of chemicals and concoctions there, some of which were medicine. Oh, God. Then he's... Oh, God, no. Go look at the treatment center. No, there was nothing even... Rem you went there, too, didn't you? The only thing in the treatment center are those... Stick him in a pod! Quark? Quark! Oh, hide the scalpels! Oh, thank you. You're away. Get away from me. What? I can't. Have to what? What are you talking about? Isn't it all? I have to escape. Death is not the what? answer, my little friend. Like. Stop it. <laughs> Grab him. No. <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Hold him down. Bond. Me too. Stop. Oh, right. Hold Damn it down! Damn you, bastard! Why won't you let me go? I have to get out of this body! They can't lock away the soul once 
My body's gone. My soul can escape. Please. You have to let me go. No. Let me go. I'm trapped here. Let me die. I have to die. No. Kill me. No. Somebody. Anybody. No. Kill me. Kill me. No. Ah! Stop screaming. Somebody take away his murder weapon. Luna. Yes? Are there any tranquilizers in here? No. Well, what? They're Super L Beta. Use it. Super L? That's the, the one that's in our bracelet. Good. Hit him with some of that. What? He'll be fine. It's just an anesthetic. To, it won't hurt him. But. Just hurry up. Come on, Luna. Somebody knock him out. Okay. Let me just. Okay. I've got it. Good. Wait until he... Now! Do it now! Right! No! Stop! Stop! Got him. We saved the day. <sighs> Respiration, blood pressure, brain... According to these readings... Yes. What about the anesthetic? How long will it last? He shouldn't wake up for a few hours. Man, he sure was strong for such a little guy. I think that might be the virus's fault. Stupid virus. It probably attacks the part of the brain that governs... Yeah? Huh? Oh, wh How much do you know about this radical sick? Oh, I probably know all I've seen about it. Why would I lie? I've seen other viruses do the same th So when Quark tried to kill himself... Yes, at least... Come um, on, Tenmyoji. What do you... Tell us. Alice? Grab her! We're all going to die. Grab her! Huh? We're all dead already. Only terrorists would resort to biological warfare. Uh, hey! You don't understand? Oh, no. All of humanity. The virus will spread. Adults. Children. Everyone. Everyone. There won't be anyone left. Oh, no. I, I'd rather die here. Somebody stop her. Oh, dear God. You lost? Well, let's split quickly. Right. Look, if you just do your best not to provoke, understood? Got Ten it. Mioji, the rest of us can sound good? I stay here. All right, let's okay. move. Get going. She's in the garden, isn't she? My premonition senses are tingling. No, don't go to the lounge. What am I doing? She's not gonna be in here. My sixth sense is telling me she's in the garden. Run faster, me. Where are you? What are you thinking? You're not fast enough. We need Sanic to get in here to find her. He's fast enough. Book it! Friend, like your life depends on it, because it probably does. Oh no! We're all going to die. Let's go and check the garden. Ignore the jellyfish and the clock. What are you looking at? She's not in here. Move a little bit faster, come on. Yes, you do need to hurry. Did you just say he's going back to the elevator? No, go to the garden, you. Good job, she's in here. I'm feeling it. 
I'm really feeling it. Um, did you knock her out? Oh, very good. Fine, did you pound I'm her? glad you showed up. Yeah, me too. I just got here a minute. She was like this. When you showed up, I was getting ready to kick. Yeah. Her breathing and pulse, she doesn't appear to have any obvious. Looks like it. Who knocked her out, though? Doesn't look like she had. Figure she probably dropped it. Anyway, we need to give me a hand here. What? We have a missing possible murder weapon? Alright, please pay it. You need to hear Adam has fin- What did it say? Her results are- She is also- Well, I figured that much as soon as she grabbed the scalpel. Oh no. No! What's going to happen to her? Well, like I said before, there's a special antiviral treatment. Do you know what immunoglobulin is? Immunogoblin? Wait, I remember what? seeing something like that. We don't, uh, note about the IG. We need Ig. And, uh, uh, Ig. It's another name for antibodies. Those antibodies are the base. We need some IG. Right. I thought of that too. Unfortunately. Correct. They can suppress the symptoms for the only way we can help Alice. But the pods will keep them from getting any worse. Yes. Well, then what one of you grab out? We're going to the tree. Chink. Hey, I found the medicine. What? Well, what is it? Excelivir, you found it, Sigma. Woohoo! I saved the day. It's the one thing that can cure Wait, Radical where did Six. It fall from? Why did Quark have the cure? Uh, why did Quark have it? That's a good question. Perhaps he found it earlier. We explored the laboratory. It was on the other side of the red door. I happened to notice Quark. Whether or not that was his, I did not have the opportunity. It didn't feel a pro to be honest. It had all. We were rather preoccupied with getting. Who cares about- We have it! Hurry up and give it to him. Uh, hey, what about Al- Does it really matter if she goes- Um, I'm sorry. What? There's only enough here for one person. Oh, no! The only way we have to administer this is- And the way it functions. In other words, we can't split the dose in two or something. Right. Get another bottle and pour half of it in. Nothing. That one bottle was it. No. Unfortunately, can no. we make more? Oh God! Justin, only one person can. Who should we give it to? Alice or Quark? Uh oh. Okay, this isn't the decision part. A story lock. Then what are we going to do? <laughs> Some way to save both of them. Do we get to all right? Story lock. So, quick question. Now that we know that she has the virus in this part, can we go back over to this one and progress? Proof it wasn't murder? Can we do that? Oh, damn it! I always do that. It's right here. We have to have proof that Alice wasn't murdered. Now that we've gone to here and seen that she also has the virus, 
is it possible to go back to this one, proof that it wasn't a murder, lock number two, and show that she... Okay, nope. All right. Well, in that case, let's go to the flow. Um, what should I do next? Should I go back here and betray? Should I go here and betray? Should I go here and betray? Should I go here and betray? Let's do... Let's let ourselves get seduced by Clover. I think that's going to be real fun. Lots of fun. So, uh, Clover, I hear you're going to try to seduce... Hey, Sigma, I wanted to ask you something. Could you pick me tri- I mean, I could- But you're so big and strong, you'd probably just throw me on the ground and that'd be it. Please, compliment me more. So I thought I might as well just ask you really nicely. Mm -hmm. Oh, I mean, I'd be happy to, um, pay you back. Oh, what type of paying me back are we talking about here? If you just pick Betray for me, then I'll listen to anything you say. Anything? Yep, anything. You have my attention. So think carefully, okay? Okay. If you choose ally... Uh-huh. Are you really, really the only safe choice? Then I'll have... But you don't need to worry about that. Even if I do get 9 BP... I mean, Alice... And I can't leave her behind? Uh-huh. Please, will you pick Betray? 20 seconds. I think I will. Oh, that's, uh... Not the skip button. There you go. Happy birthday. Round two. Results from please. Wow. Where is Alice anyways? Alright, Clover, where's my reward? Hand it over. Points, what am I getting? Please. So, promises are made to be broken, I see. No, she seduced me. I could have chosen, but that was a That was a completely different... Well, in any event, how do you intend to deal... Rip. Look, I believe she's standing in front of the... Hold on! You said you'd listen to anything I say, you filthy scrub! Clover! Alright. That's another quick bad ending. Not that I totally didn't expect that to happen oh. at all. She opened it. Shit. What? 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 Sorry, Alice gave me an order though. Clover, you have to get out of here and call for help. My BP's down to one. I'll have to play the AB game at least three more times in order to get to nine. If someone beats me to it, that can't. I'm giving you an order. Escape. Commanding officer. <laughs> Promise? So? I am, aren't I? Every little word is... What? Ew. Were you here a perv? No, she... Uh... My reward. My dignity. Honor. The number nine door. It will re... Anyway. Clover! Clover! Fucking bitch! You're not getting out of here! Bye, guys. Bye. And Clover has gone forever. Sweet. Lovely. Just, just what I always wanted. The number this end. Thank you. As the escape is, please enjoy. She's gone. Shit! Help, let's hope there's still someone who can. Game over! 
sweet. It doesn't take too long to get to. 